because it would be a shame not to have FaZe Clan rocking out. But I mean, look at this roster. Arsenal's on this map. Cold Zera, don't forget about him. Nico, Kirby, major champion at 18. And Brokey, the young Latvian who Latvi can more often than not. Looks pretty sharp on the AWP. But look at this. Hiding over towards Car on that. Hey, long side of things. They'll get the opening. RPK takes down Rain. And it will just be a BP. So smoke towards the door. Flashes will come over. Masuta back a platform. What can he get done here? Survival. Nade damage, though. And now with the flashbang, he peeks. Kirby did well to knock him off his perch. And that's the announcement of Marcus Kirby, ladies and gentlemen. Nako as well. Clearing out the tunnels is more where that came from. Bomb down. Rotating in loudly. Zaiwu and RPK. We walking into Nico's crosshair, and he's gone. He's out of there, and the tanks arrived in the kill feed. Triple kill. We got an ace on our hands. He's thinking about it. Does spot Kirby wide swing. Reactions aren't there. His teammate Zywu's there for the help, though. And poor old Kirby just met RPK's USP. Four kills in the pistol, and the Frenchman secures the pistol round. Yeah, good stuff. That was uh, quite the retake to come on through. Out immediately against this force by straight over towards Long. Apex goes down. RPK trades out one. And here comes the orb. I don't think they'll be ready for this one. Second round orb, but he's missing shot. This gets awkward oh, now. No. He's burning. No shots hit. FaZe taking full control of the second round force. And a freebie as well. Shocks walk straight into their jaws. This is a start. And it's a good one at that for FaZe Clan. Straight out the loss of the pistol. RPK dominating. But now poor old Masuta, our newest addition to the pro tips. He's going to have to do it all. Bombs on towards A. And God, it would be great if we could turn off these lights. I'm about to say it loud. Uh, I, I, I put it in the group, so we're getting as many forms of communication yep. across as I'm we can. I'm just going to call them out publicly because they <laughs> clearly can't hear me in the production room. It's, it's hot. It's hot in here, guys. Can't see the screen. My job is to talk about what's on He's the screen. Pushed out of position. Oh, my God. Kirby's banging for this. Are you checking this close left? Oh, I doubt it. The suitor is. Nice. Doubt's dashed, and they find first blood on this force buy. Now look at the nades left over. We have two Molotovs, a H or two HEs, and a couple of flashes. Now, ooh, uh -oh. Apex very, very lucky to stay alive right there. But look how many of the CTs are over towards the A side. It's all five. They've yeah. given up B through because of this push. Oh, this That's... is going to suck for them. They're about to get flash naded. Mot incendiaries as well. Trying to get across though. No pins pulled. No damage inflicted. And Rain takes the head off of shocks. And another as well. Finally, Masuta gets the dunk and a second as well. Masuta's trying to do it all. And RPK is now in a 1v1. They've managed to make this winnable. He has no armor. He has to pull the trigger first, and he's unable to do so. And so Nico. Vitality last time they played. Oh. Double Great kill stuff. from Kirby. There you go. Round over. Didn't expect to see so many casualties. I hadn't considered three CTs were up on long, but the, all the fracks go and face his way, puts the poor Vitality gang on B on notice. The fact that they're pausing is just making me a little uncomfortable because there is a world where Misuta just holds his knife out and charges towards T-Spawn, but That's all right. we're all good. And they're starting to move now and gather towards the wide open A site. So I'm thinking something that might be indicative of what Nico was saying about they just do their defaults and then they're too scared to move forward from that or take any risks. You can associate that potentially with opening kills. And if you look at the opening kill stats right now for the side of things for FaZe in those 13 maps prior to starting this one, Nico was the highest. So his, his attempts was the highest percentage attempts, roughly 29%, just under. And his success was... 45%. That was the highest in the team. Then it went Rain. Then it went Brokey, Your Orpa, Kirby, and Cold Zero down the bottom. The, uh, the old uh, Apex. You gotta come go on, from guys. the side. Come on, fellas. You gotta go from the side. Now, people always jump. try and go from the front, but you have to go from the side. There we go. Look at Shox's position. Kirby should lose his head. Good precision. Execution. Will this really be the round? Don't forget, Zywu has an Orp, and he's on the right side. Rain's got something in store nice for us. Molly. A little skybox Molly to force Apex into a wider fight. RPK tucked in on the elevator and Cold Sarah spots him out. This is the first, and that's Zywu. Biggest scalp done, oh. but RPK's knocking off scalps and handing out headshots. Good grief, I didn't expect that. Four frags from the tank. He's just smashing through the competition. Back we go. RPK, the hero of last, ready to deliver once again. Flash comes over. Tucks away, he's on his own on an island. RPK with the AK, damage done, nade. It's good. Ouch. Well, that's going to put some energy in the Vitality camp, isn't it? Cavalry's on the way. Ash is good. RPK gets a freebie. No, he doesn't. Kirby still 
Fully flashed and converted. Apex and Zywu holding on the long and Brokey, oh, he spots him and does execute nice one. Shot. Needs another. Knows Apex was close and this should be a really easy connection. Ooh. So good shots. Still a minute left, there's a yeah. world. There's a world where a 1v4 happens straight after the ridiculousness and the brain melter that was RPK's Desert Eagle using his utility to get across. He's playing this well. <gasps> you smart boy, the sound cue though. Masuta tucked in and not caught out. It will be the third for Vitality and it's a team ace right, as so well. They want short control. See the one I'm talking about just here. That would lock anybody in. Oh, it's a fast onto A. <laughs> it's like the A smoke all the way from spawn. And they use it to great success. Crossing away, missed shot. RPK though is just hitting everything. Who is this man? How old is this man? I don't care anymore. It's the frags that matter. Triple kill. Again, the round just ends thanks to Vitality's tank. You know how Taz got a Mercedes? Yeah, Maybe it's time RPK an gets a tank. tank. He just drives through the streets of Paris in a tank. Oh, Apex to finish off the last two here. Fantastic stuff. And that was Can't great work. It. What would have happened in that situation? Zywu baits them all in. And this crossfire should be set up for success. Good molly. The only option is to drop. And that's what Brokey opts for in the spray. Oh, dear. This is destruction. Vitality, a new lease of life. Brokey's Deagle, no slouch in a bad spray. Suddenly a three on three, rotate in. They know there's two B players, you know RPK's long. Like we have the same information as FaZe right now. And that's a great shot. He's RPK. so crisp today. He is. Precision across the board, Brokey's Deagles. Oh no, a war of attrition. Lost out, brings him down to two HP, but RPK, surely he's got another one in the bag. An unarmored Nico, I like the Deagle. I've had my mind blown by this very same Deagle skin before in the very same hands. And all he has to do is survive. Nico running down that clock. This is exactly what he needed to do. Does take down shocks. It's RPK, a tag on the first, a repeak, a pre-fire. He has closed the gap, but does he have time? He's got plenty. That is unbelievable scenes, Jeff. Vitality. Oh, take oh they're actually, they're, they're bitten into this completely. It's a great fake. So it finds one out. Oh, okay, maybe it's better than this. They've been able to deal with two just crossing completely dry. Now they have to drop the utilities. Zywu pushes forward. He's gonna grab another. The no scope's good. Brokey's left on an island. And look, Cold Zero, he's still in T spawn. Yeah, this is a nightmare. Brokey though with a double does have a chance to perhaps try and get that bomb down. I told a lie. Apex is the one to shatter the dreams and to secure the sixth on this CT side. Gosh, does to a perfect battleground, I think, for these two teams to start it off. Wouldn't you say, Chad? Yeah, I mean, site play and Rain, he's gonna look away. Oh, is he? This is all comes down to timing here for RPK. And the timing is on his side. The tank rolls forward and he will have a dank flank. Ouch! That's Nico arriving in the kill feed for two. Zywu. Look look at RPK. Yeah, this you're right. The bomb. You're right, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. Wasn't ready. Okay. Round done. Round over. And there's the half wit. Zywu and Shocks, the duo, yet to come online, so. If they can get activated on this T side, we could be in for a long one. Smoke over. Flash will follow. And Cold Zero, what can you do, my friend? Well, not a lot. So side's open. RPK continues where he left off. Rain on the flank with two nice shots. Yeah, that's a good start. Maybe we've got a round after all. Masuta low. Certainly in the armor department. Bomb down courtesy of shocks. You can see a kit there for the CTs. Really accessible. And doesn't look like they'll both. need it. But bloodshed on the first and tapping away. Shocks just needs one bullet. Kirby holding his nerve. It's so close. They need to reload. Two bullets in Shox's gun. One bullet opts for the reload. Kirby, he's got time. He just needs to find the frag. And one bullet will do it at this point. 21 points of health. Another tag for shocks. Kiyomi down to 34. This dance is getting awkward. It's getting really oh. ugly, and that's not going to be nice. Of course he wants to play with this. He might actually get a chance to do it. Oh, man, if Cold baits him in with a sick little wandy here. Need to see it about. Now there's Brokey. He even grabs the Galil and gets a kill. He's opened up the round. Cold Zera can't quite close it. Nico can, though. Masuta gone on the extremities. Shocks to clutch up. A Zeus kill and a picked up Galil. That's one magnificent pairing to get the double kill started on the B-side push. But now they flood in and nearly three, holding down Mouse one. Kiyabi. a 100% success rate in this round. Let's see if Vitality can find their 11th, tip them back into favor. Limited util for the CTs at this point. In fact, so limited, it's just on Kiyabi, tucked on Goose. 
Smoke perhaps towards short at the 30 second mark could be his best bet. And it does look like he's going to be trying to control them, but it's all smoke and mirrors. They're going middle. Chad draws our attention there. Brokey has so much to do. He's got to find RPK. A little jiggle and the frags just keep coming in. RPK onto another. Kia being cold forced to save. So I don't know how many kills we saw there at Chadney. I think that was a grand total of zero. Okay, so I wasn't keeping track, but it did feel like zero. There's, There's one. one. Nice. Victory will be that of Cold Zera and that of Kirby. Looks like they're setting up for a standard temporal pincer maneuver here, Alex. It is the tenet of all Counter-Strike matches. So I really, like, I have a real cheesy one because, you know, I like Mighty Ducks. Yes. There's a skater. It's Mighty Ducks, by the way, not Muddy Ducks. I know. Hold up. Yeah, he's lost his life. Yeah, that's a problem. That was one of the heroes. There's another tucked in the corner, though. RPK with low HP confirms. In shot, can't trade it either. Needed this from Cold. I was low, gone down, and triple kill from Cold. Oh. Now Nico fills the feed with his Deagle. It's a one versus two. He does have time to play with, but the in-game leader Apex was not planning on this sort of action. Now with recovered AKs, the one question is going to come down to Apex pulling the trigger first, as well as isolating these jewels. Oh, rain. Hard okay. headshot, but he does hit it. Surely Nico wins this. I mean, look at the health. If if Apex was to shoot first. Oh, here we go. A standoff of big brains. Oh, no way. Oh, he doesn't hit it. He doesn't hit the shots. He does now. Kept the spray. He knew no armor on present. B. Bombs going that way. Rain can't really contest. Cut the back of a smoke. He's actually playing around it. And oh, so Shoxy. At least they have two players to stop this B push, but it's just a contact play. They're not making any noise, and Herky can only get one. Oh, it's all over. Red Rover. The kills happen everywhere. Like, this isn't, like, Team Vitality limped out mid, got a kill, then they walked through. And... No, access to long. This is a very classic Vitality maneuver. You can see he's going to drop the bomb and set himself up in pit. I want to know how Zoe gets into the pit. Run boost. Ah. That's one way to do it. Bang! Oh my god, I was about to scream. Nico, however, does have a screamer of a spray. Practically three. He doesn't finish it off with the USP. RPK tried to clear B. Cold Zera not to beat. And that's the end of round 26. Oh, they come back, right? Yeah. And they need to make sure they're doing it relatively cleanly because their money is not fantastic. So for Vitality, it can be more of a war of attrition. But Masuta, well... He's hungry and he's hungry now. Cold Sarah's got a snack in front of him though. Four C's on that one. Does take down Apex. Quickly traded. So starting to decelerate now as FaZe's chances rest on just three shoulders. Nico. Resmoking to reposition. He should be able to try and get up onto that A side. But the unknowing presence of Misuta, that frag he found on Rain right at the start of the game, means they have to be careful. And that's what this boost is all about. He pops Kirby up. Interesting that they didn't opt for the AWP, but he's going to be given the responsibility of short. And now... As the smoke fades, Kirby advancing. He's not ready. And he's been oh, caught no. out by the tank. Nico in vulnerable situation at this point. They're all gathering their resources. They're all heading to Nico's port of call. And all he can do is stand in limbo. This is so awkward. Surely you'd want to tuck in, find some cover. He can support the mid to B as well. I understand why he's still there. Long, an unknown un entity. He might catch Zywo off here. The off angle. It's good. Masuta needs to trade this. Jiggling. Jiggling. Nico's not falling for it. Needs another. Quick flick. Not going to connect. A two on two, though. Oh. Now RPK finally fills the feed for his 24th. At least Nico's made it winnable. A one on two, much better than a one on four. Brokey. Advancing. Ascending. Hoping for not the jump shot. I assume it's just the element of surprise. We're in his eyes now. He does make noise. A challenge. It's a hard one. Just jiggling around. Shox does go down. Where's the trade? Looking to confirm it. Does get the shot. Gets the info. Peeking off his flash. No one's home. And that's the duel. RPK has done it for Vitality.